What's up guys and welcome to the tarot. I'm an energy and intuitive reader and I'm here to do the collective reading for everybody. What's up guys? So I'm going to do the collective reading um, just in general see what's going on with the collective today. I'm going to do two parts. The first part is going to be tarot. The second part is going to be just oracles um, and I'll put the timestamps below in case yeah rather one or the other but I like to break it down because that's just me. All right. I hope you guys are doing beautifully well today, my beautiful people. All right. So let's see what's going on. Let's see. Some of you guys could be dealing with a Leo or a Sagittarius. Um, or you could be that. Okay. All right. Let's see the collective spirit. What's going on? What are we talking about? The Emperor. That's Aries energy. Okay, so you're taking charge of something. You're taking charge of the situation. The Page of Swords. Okay, communication is coming in. I feel like you're going to like this communication. The Hangman. Yeah, it's going to make you change your perspective. Oh my gosh, my heart is still <laughs> Hold on. What the freak? This could be about love. Um, I feel like it's going to it's gonna like enlighten you. Um, whatever this is. The Star. It's going to be an Aquarius. This is your wish, bro. Your wish is here. Your wish is here. But you're going to have to look at it from a different perspective in order for you to see that it's your wish. You have the three of wands in reverse. I feel like the waiting is over. The temperance. Wow. Sagittarius. Did I not say Sag? The temperance is here. I feel like this is coming in because you're balanced. Because you brought peace and harmony into a situation. Wow. The only thing we're missing is a freaking justice card. You have the Queen of Pentacles in reverse. I feel like you're going to have to stop nurturing something, though. And you have the Chariot, all right? So I feel like um, things are definitely going to be moving forward for you. You you could be moving as well, um, or a car could be significant. But I feel like something's about to come in for you. You have the Page of Pentacles. Look at that. There's definitely an offer coming in here um, that you've been waiting for. And it's coming. But it's like the universe wanted you to get right first before this comes in. Um, you could be an Aries, uh, Aquarius, a Sagittarius, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, or Cancer. Okay. All right. Let's see. What is this um, Emperor? You have the seven of wands in reverse. Yeah, I feel like seven of wands is not fighting. So I, I feel like you took control without, without being too controlling, if that makes sense. It's like you chose to go a certain direction, but you didn't control the way that you were going, right? It's kind of like you're just like, you know what? I, I know I want to go, you know... um. How can I say this? No. Hmm. I'm trying to think of a good way to explain this. Um, it's kind of like you were like, you were just like, you know what? I know I want to go on a road trip, but like you weren't spit. Like, it's like, you're just like, you, you, you don't care where you go. You just know you want to go on a road trip and you want it to be fun and you want it to be great. Right. And you were just like, I'm going to allow the universe to, um, direct me or guide me or bring me what they need what they think would be the best route for me you know what i'm saying like you took control you were like i know what direction i want to go but the you know maybe you're just like who's gonna come with me or you know where the direction is going to lead me i'll let the universe decide and that's why you're getting this this is amazing all right what is this page of swords you have the sun here twice why did i say twice some of you guys are about to be really happy like two times like <laughs> maybe you knew this was going to make you happy but it's going to make you even happier than that um i feel like this communication is going to make you really happy here this could be a leo the page of pentacles you're going to have to change your perspective because i feel like it's going it's not going to be a Whatever this offer is or whatever this thing is, it's not going to be as big as you expected it to be. That's another thing, too. Make sure you watch those expectations, okay? But I feel like it's something solid, something good, and something that you could trust. But it is something new, okay? You have the temperance here twice. You've done, you've done good. You've healed. You've, you've balanced out energies. Like, you've done good. Like, you're going to get your wish because you've done good. 
like very much well deserving good for you bro the lovers is in reverse um i feel like there's a i feel like for a very long time there was a disconnect between you and achieve and getting this it was like it was very hard for you to see the way but i feel like it was hard because you were trying to control it you know you were like it has to be this way but i feel like you released that with the seven of wands in reverse what is this temperance the two of wands is in reverse yeah i feel like you brought peace and balance into a situation that was causing a lot of delays it's like it's like you saw that your physical was being delayed so you went inward you were like okay clearly all of this is not working out because i got some stuff i gotta work on so let me just work on this stuff and you did that and you're about to see the fruits of your labor this is beautiful this is what i be telling everybody to do on my instagram you have the king of cups in reverse i feel like you're gonna have to be ruthless in an energy like you're gonna have to emotionally cut somebody off or be ruthless and not care about um detaching yourself or not nurturing something else because i feel like now ruthless i'm not i don't mean like have bad intentions for anybody or be petty that's not what i mean okay i mean like ruthless as in you can't care about how they're gonna feel by you making this move type of thing um you're gonna have to the king of cups is in reverse you're gonna have to cut off your emotions um and really just do it <laughs> like i don't even know how else to say that what is this chariot you have the work the moon is here yeah there's fear there's fear um but there's fear in the uncertainty there's fear in you don't know how this is gonna go you don't know how this is gonna turn out but that's okay just because there's fear doesn't mean not to do it you should absolutely do it okay bottom of the deck is a justice in reverse i feel like um you've been down this road before in a different with a different energy in a different time um that could be where the fear is coming from um I don't feel like this is what's going to happen this time. You have two temperance cards here. Okay, you have done the work. You have done the healing. You have you have done it. All right, so you deserve it. All right, let's go another. All right, you have the page of wands in reverse. Yeah, I feel like it, it didn't start off too great. <laughs> there might have been delays in this starting off, but I feel like it's because you wasn't completely done with the healing. All right. You have the tower in reverse. I also feel like the first time around, um, it didn't work out because you were avoiding something. You didn't want to change something that needed to change. The king of wands, but you're ready now. I'm ready. She's ready. You have this confidence in you now too that is a that is beautiful. You have the six of wands in reverse. That before, if you would have took it, if you would have, if you would have, if it would have worked out before, no, it wouldn't have worked out before because you didn't have the confidence that you have now. Okay, it's like that that confidence the universe wanted you to get. You needed that boost. The king of cups is here. Yeah, you're ready now. You're freaking ready. The page of cups is in reverse. Listen to your intuition. Yeah, you're going to have to go about this. You're going to have to go about this, you know, in a way that you're not going to want to. You're going to have to separate yourself from some type of marriage commitment, um, home, foundation, institution. I don't know. All right. And that might not make you too happy because I feel like you... Um, Either they depend on you and you're just like, oh, I don't want to leave them. Or it's that you depend on them. You know, but I feel like they're wherever the new that you're starting is going to be so much better. And it's it's freshly new. Like you could you could create it and make it however you want. That's the best part of new beginnings. OK, so. Um, yeah, that's all that I have for the tarot portion. I am going to Oracle now. I'm just going to clean up. Clean up, clean up. Everybody do your share. Clean up, clean up. Hold on, I'm mixing these cards up. 
So how's everybody doing today? How 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 are you guys living? I, I mean, I know this is a one-way situation right now. Um, I had thought about doing lives. That has crossed my mind. I feel like eventually down the road, I'll do it. Um, live is, is a lot of energy. Live is um, a lot of energy. But I do want to like interact with y'all um, like that. So, you know not anytime soon <laughs> but i you know it will come it will come it will come okay all right so what are we doing what are we doing i was gonna pull this this deck but this is like about love though but we'll do it we shall do it all right oracle portion what's up oracle people how y'all doing today i hope you guys are doing swell amazingly swell all right so serendipity in reverse so something is not what you thought something is not what you thought hold on a second i had to write the title for you all right so um serendipity is in reverse i feel like something did not turn out to be how you thought all right you have forgiveness i feel like the universe wants you to forgive the situation forgive you and the person involved you have the silver waterfall in reverse i feel like i mean it didn't match your fly i feel like this it wasn't it wasn't something that you were going to be able to benefit from okay i'm not getting love but it could be but i'm not getting that you have worthiness. I feel like you you know your worth. And I feel like you're worth more than that. Okay? I don't I don't know if you're upset about something not working now, but I feel like you know that you're worth more. You have creativity. Yeah, I feel like um once you once this doesn't work out, it's like you have all these ideas. You have all of these it's like all of this stuff just starts coming to you. your creativity gets better. I feel like you're able to come up with certain um plans and ideas that you have been kind of stuck on you have love um i feel like there's there's um more of a appreciation and a love for yourself after this situation and you have resolving conflict and reverse don't hold grudges don't hold grudges that's not good okay you have manifestations in reverse yeah you're gonna block your blessings um I'm gonna have to edit this video. You're gonna have to give me a second because my thing is gonna die and my charger's all the way over there. So I'll be back. All right, we're back. Um, so yeah, don't hold a grudge, okay? Because it is going to stop um your new beginning from coming in or whatever you're asking the universe for, right? All right, so what is serendipity? You have be proud of yourself. Yeah, I feel like the universe wants you to be proud. Even though something didn't work out, it doesn't mean anything. This could have to be with your with your finances or your stability or a Taurus. <laughs> but it doesn't it doesn't mean that it's over. It doesn't mean that the world is, you know what I'm saying? Like I feel like you you held on as as long as you could. What's forgiveness? You have breathed through the tension. Yeah, I do feel like it's tough forgiving yourself and the other energy because I feel like it was not um you know it's like something beautiful turned ugly type of thing but i feel like the universe wants you to woo breathe through the tension don't ignore the tension they want you to really be in there and learn how to be okay with the tension being there but forgiveness will help and soften that as well um what is the silver waterfall in reverse you have revealed what needs to be seen. Yeah, and I feel like this not working out. You're now seeing that it really didn't match her flow. It really didn't like go with the in the same movement that you move. It didn't really move. It's like it wasn't, you know, like you're you're downstream and this energy was upstream. Like it was just contradicting each other. But now you see that. I feel like it I feel like that was hidden before. What is worthiness here? 
you have trust all will be well yeah i feel like you did good you know your worth you chose good here um also there's something going on with your health everything is going to be fine okay but um i feel like everything is going to be fine because you you chose you you made a decision based off of your worth because you know what you're worth okay what is creativity is go for it all right yeah i feel like you're gonna get some type of new idea or something new is gonna come into your space and the universe wants you to jump on it it's a new beginning you're literally gonna get a new beginning right after you decide that or what after this doesn't work out whatever this is over here all right and the universe wants you to go for it all right what's this love um you have assessed the situation all right so i feel like now, remember how I said that this is going to give you, I don't know if I said it, but it's going to give you a, bit, a better appreciation of yourself. This self-love that you're going to have for yourself is going to be so amazing. But within that love, right, there <laughs> there has to be a balance in this, in this universe. Within that love that you're going to find within yourself, you're also going to realize that there's people around you. There's, uh, you're in, in a, it's like you're going to be open to everything else around you that does not match the vibration that you're on it's going to be very evident that you are vibrating at a different frequency at a different energy than those around you and <clears throat> the universe wants you to assess that those people i'm not saying cut people off and yeah you know but really assess really like peep you know what i'm saying because I, like i feel like Take a reality check. For some of y'all, you do have you you are gonna have to cut some people off, okay? Um, or create really really hard boundaries, okay? Like no more chit chatting every day at twelve o'clock, you know. <laughs> no more, you know. There's certain things, and, and I feel like the universe doesn't want you to feel like you're doing anything wrong by this. It's just that it doesn't match your frequency anymore. This is like you you growing up, like you don't fit a size three anymore right you're grown now so you know don't try to fit into place into places that you no longer fit all right what is um resolving conflict in reverse something about 22 could be significant um take inspired action i feel like the universe doesn't want you to hold any grudge towards anybody in this situation all right you have find a, find a balance. Yeah, they want you to find a balance with what's going on. Figure out how you can make, you know, figure out how you can um, balance out the situation, but not without holding a grudge and without being petty or malicious, okay? Be logical, all right? You could be a Libra, a Virgo, an Aries, um, a Scorpio, or a Taurus watching this, but you don't have to be. All right, let's get one more. You have lust. Yeah, I feel like this looked and this looked smelled and tasted amazing at first. But I feel like that's what it was. It was it was like that so it could lure you in, so it could, you know, make you go to it and make you want to stay. You have meditation. Yeah, but I feel like you took some time before you made this decision. That's why the universe is saying you are worthy. This is this is a good choice because you didn't this wasn't a rash decision that you made. You know, you really sat on the decision before you made it. You have reminder. Um, I feel the universe doesn't want you to forget what you're worth. And this is why they wanted you to, this is why this didn't work out over here because they wanted you to know that you're worth more. And they wanted you to like, but they wanted you to kind of to remind you about that by showing you that, that that's not what you're worth. All right. You have honesty. I feel the universe wants you to be honest with yourself going forward, no matter what. Okay. Be honest with yourself first so that before you're honest with anybody else. You have success. Yes. It's gonna everything is gonna work out beautifully. And everything is working out beautifully. That was supposed to happen. Just because that happened doesn't mean that things are not falling into place. I just feel like you have with this creativity, you have certain people or certain ideas coming in that is gonna show you that you made the right choice. 
you have fragment yeah and i feel like you kind of know that i feel like you kind of know that you're kind of seeing it but you don't have the full picture you might not have full um it might not be at full throttle right now but it's going to be okay you have strength yeah i feel like this is something that's gonna i'm getting slow burn um like something that's gonna um, gradually become better but i feel like right now it, it is simmering because it's like the universe is like helping you get your strength back from this situation that um, didn't work out as you wanted it to, okay? All right, that's all that I have for you guys. I hope this helps. Have a good day or a good night whenever you watch this and stay positive.